I'm here. Once this frenzy's over, those come from Texas. These are the black Australorps. I'm getting two of these. And I'm also getting two of the buffed Orpingtons. You want to see them drawn up there. Thank you. And here they are. They're home now and all tucked in. So what I got is two buff Orpingtons. They're such a mild breed and they're so beautiful. And I got two black Astralorps, if that's how I'm pronouncing it right. They're so beautiful when the sun hits their feathers, they actually turn a hint of blue. And then I got two Americanas. The Americanas are so cool because they lay a bluish greenish colored egg. I thought that would be really, really fun for when my granddaughter comes to visit. Super happy with what they had at the store. So the funny story is, I actually picked up four originally. And then I got home and I thought about it and I said, ah, oh, I wanna get two more. So I went back and got the other two and I couldn't be more pleased. Now, if you'll notice in the video I made how to set up a brooder, I originally had bricks as my platform, but I needed to use those bricks in a landscaping project yesterday. So I just cut the bottom off of boxes and they made great platforms. And in case you did not watch that video, the reason why I like to keep the food and the water on a platform is so when the chicks scratch in their bedding, they won't get anything inside the water and it keeps the food clean. So it just keeps the food and water feeders cleaner when you have them elevated a little bit. One of the important things about having baby chicks is you want to handle them a lot. And I don't mean hold them for hours, but basically just pick them up, give them a little love, because when the chickies become adults, they're going to need you to handle them a lot when you have to give them treatments or check them for parasites or anything like that. So it's a good habit to get into just holding your baby chicks. And you can kind of pretend that your hand is its mother. See how calm this little girl is? She's completely fine with me holding her. This is the little buff Orpington. Such a mild breed. Hi, baby. You're so cute. Yes, you are. What a cute little face. I love you. I talk to them and get them used to. Do you know that chickens can recognize, I think it's 30 different faces. So that's the wonderful thing about baby chicks is they just get to know you right from the start. They think you're their mother actually. Yeah. And here's my little black Astralorp. He's, she is gonna be all black when she gets bigger. So stinking cute. This is the little Americana, the one that lays blue eggs. And as the chicks get older, I'm gonna post more videos, how to hold them, there's a certain way, and all the other fun things that come along with owning chickens. They're definitely a lot of fun to watch and they're gonna change so fast. They'll look different in another week. They'll have way more feathers. And that's why I want to get pictures of them now. So I noticed that this little platform seemed to be a little bit high for the chicks. They were kind of having a hard time jumping up on it. So what I'm gonna do is add some more pine shavings just to raise up their ground level. 
I don't want to cut the platform and make it shorter because these baby chicks are going to be growing so much in the next week or so. There. That'll make it easier for them to get up there now. They were thirsty. So if you ever get baby chicks and you notice that they're not drinking, it's because they may not know how. So what you do is you just dip their beaks in water and that teaches them how to drink. They should have already done that before you picked these up in the feed store or wherever you got your chicks from. But just in case, it doesn't hurt to show them again if you're concerned. Since they don't have their mother here with them, we have to show them everything. Here's your food. Well, I hope you found this video both fun and helpful. I'll be sure to post new updates as the baby chicks continue to grow. Thanks for watching.